Hello everyone and welcome once again to Tutorials Point. Well, most of you who are seeing this video, you would probably be facing your first interview, right? Which is why you're prepping up. Or even if it is not your first interview, maybe you are very, very nervous for your interview, isn't it? And this is something that usually happens whenever you are about to face your first interview. And so was I. I was very, very nervous when I had to face my first interview. Now, especially in this video, we will see as to how do you actually answer your first interview or face your first interview with full confidence so that you are actually as successful in that. And nothing can overtake you no matter how nervous you are or no matter kind of whatever is crossing your mind I'm sure after seeing this video you're gonna be very very confident and nothing is gonna you know kind of stop you from being successful in your first interview let's go ahead okay well a very very commonly asked interview question is what are you passionate about? And how do you answer this question so as to make your first interview really, really successful? Well, this is a strategy which even I applied and I'm sure it's gonna help you a lot. No matter how nervous you are or no matter what's, you know, kind of what's crossing your mind or even if you have butterflies in your stomach, believe me, it's gonna work a lot for you because it did for me as well. So let's go ahead. Okay, now, Interview is not just about, you know, kind of cramming answers and um, just answering them right in front of the interviewer, but it is also about, you know, while you're doing your homework, your homework for that interview is also about kind of getting an insight of yourself, right? So you really need to be aware as to, you really need to actually sit and introspect as to what is it that your passion is all about or what is it that actually kind of kindles that fire in you? So it is really, really important for you to, I mean, while you're doing all the preparations, it is really important for you to also, you know, sit and introspect what is it that your passion is, right? So get a clear insight about your passion. Yes, that is very right. So be sure, I mean, I mean, it is, it is almost kind of, it is almost sure that you'll face, face this question, right? And now that you know, so because you are preparing for an interview, get a clear insight as to what your passion is about. Okay, then going forward, don't be nervous or, or don't hesitate to express what, you, what you're actually passionate about, right? So express your passion fearlessly. Believe me, this is a quality which actually impresses the interviewer a lot, right? This is what even I did while I gave my first interview. And I'm sure most of you who have actually given your interview would agree with, you know, the point that if you're very sure of yourself or, or having clarity in your mind is something that actually impresses the interviewer a lot. And that is something which they are probably looking forward to, to, to recruit a person who is actually you know, who has a lot of clarity, who knows, who is sure of what he or she is talking about, right? So that clarity to be sure of what you're saying can only come when you've introspected. And when you have that clarity, automatically whatever you say, it's going to be fearless, right? So will you be like when you would be probably telling or um, uh, explaining to the to the interviewer what your passion is about, you definitely will be able to put it forward very, very fearlessly, right? And if you do that, believe me, more than half of your job is done. Okay, then pitching in something related to your job profile would be a good idea. That is very true because doing this definitely uh, you know it's it, then it's not like you're passionate about something completely different and what you're doing is definitely not related to what your passion is right so it is a very very good idea to pitch in um, or or maybe telling about your passion which is somewhere related to what your current job is or which is somewhere related to your industry right or for that matter, even if it sounds to be very different, I mean, there definitely would be some connection which you've drived in your, which you've driven in your mind. So it definitely is, is going to help a lot if you end up um, kind of explaining the interviewer how your passion 
or or how the, the the work that you're doing how is it linked to what your passion is and how does it help you to be really productive in the work that you do on a day-to-day -day basis right so once you're able to link your passion with the your current job or the industry wherein you work definitely I mean it's a green signal believe me and yes it worked a lot for me even I did the same when I faced my interview and believe me it turned out to be a huge success so will it for you so do not hesitate if you are explaining your passion or do not uh, worry about probably putting something forward which you feel is your passion but you feel that um, it might it might not impress the interviewer well not really if you are able to derive that connection between your passion and your job well then it's done it definitely uh, creates a good impact okay of course this is also a question which I mean might just come your way and you can be almost sure about it what motivates you right so what is it that motivates you well of course even I was asked this question when I faced my first interview now here is a strategy as to how you should be answering this in order to be very 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 sure that the interviewer would I mean almost um, be convinced that you are the right, right choice for this job okay now reflect on your past experiences this part of it part of the answer definitely comes in your homework right so while you're preparing it is definitely a good idea to sit as as we've already discussed to sit and reflect upon yourself do some introspection get to know yourself as to what is it that i like what is it that i'm passionate about what is it that motivates me so all these are the things which you need to be first clear about right so that i mean why you need to do this homework is precisely so that when you are um, you know when you have to face this question it's not that it just takes you by a surprise you're you completely don't know what you i mean you, you're not even aware of yourself and you just went there for an interview well it won't be a very good position to be in it might just land you in a tight spot because the impression which it gives is gives is that you are not even sure of your own self which i'm not sure is the best idea to portray while you are giving your interview okay so while you will be reflecting on your past experiences um, during your preparation for your interview i'm sure you would be able to find out something that you are passionate about or something that just that it just motivates you to um, you know do any work that you do so what is your motivating factor so reflect upon yourself and come to this answer so that you know what is it that motivates you in any particular job now try to align it with the role and the company of course invariably the thumb rule of answering your interview questions definitely lies in the fact that you're able to align whatever you're answering to the to the to the job role or to the company right or to the work that you are going to do so if you're able to align it with the role and the company well then it it definitely works wonders and not just um, you know you are going to theoretically express it but tell a story but be honest about it yes so if you're able to back up whatever you're saying with a solid evidence which could be in the form of a story well then your work is done because so did i when i gave my first interview and definitely it helped me a lot and believe you me this is the best strategy to answer this question whenever you are in an interview so reflect upon yourself get to know what motivates you align it with the job role that you've applied for and then back it up with an evidence what are you left with you're completely done well you'll be completely prepared to give your interview and i'm sure it's going to turn out to be a huge success and you definitely don't need to be you know kind of nervous at all because you have done your preparation fully and completely so friends we will see you again in the next video till that time Keep learning with tutorials, point and tutorials. Have a good day.